20 straight times. Ohio State won Big Ten games. Illinois coming in. Game already tied at seven. Maurice Wells in the backfield for the Buckeyes. And Ohio State number one in the BCS. Seemingly on their way to New Orleans to play for the national championship. Up 14 to seven. But Juice with Jacob Willis right down the middle. And the Illini staying in it. Tying the game at 14. And Juice goes to work late in the half mark. And Juice Williams is doing a tremendous job of spotting his wide receivers. He finds the open wide receiver, Brian Gamble, for this one for the score. 21-14 and a momentum carrier into the half. And this was a momentum changer. Todd Beckman trying to buy time. Ill-advised, Lou. Well, he just scrambled there and a great play by the cornerback from Illinois, which deflects the ball and ends up being a turnover for... Ohio State and Illinois goes on here. Antonio Steele with the pick. Williams again with the play fake. Four touchdown passes. The Illini up 28 to 14. When the Buckeyes get in trouble, what do they do, Mayday? They run the football. Chris Wells right over the right side. Powers in for the score. Seven, Be no, seven, seven. Beanie's second touch of the day, and it's a 28-21 game. Beckman looking for his comfort zone receiver, Brian Rubisky, but this one is put in traffic and maybe a tad underthrown. His third interception of the game, 11 on the year. The Scarlet and Gray people flustered. Now, under seven minutes to go. Zook almost punted this thing. Look where he is. He's barely across his 34th and inches. And the Zooker gets it on the quarterback sneak. Third and seven on the drive, and Juice Williams run. Well, he gets good blocking, but it's a quarterback counter. The tackle pulled around, blocked the linebacker. And you just can't defend a good running quarterback. Third and ten, what happened? The quarterback draw, nice block from the lead back. Once again, fake the pass like an isolation. Boom, the defense on. Oh, and look. This is against a rush defense that was giving up only 65 yards per game and forced three and out on 44% of opponents' possessions, and they couldn't get the ball back at the end. And Illinois upsets Ohio State. Bonnie Burns team with Ron Zook. Coach Zook, congratulations. You know, when your team lost 40 to 2 two years ago, you told your team in the locker room after the game it was going to be much different two years later. Why was that the case today? Because uh, our guys believed. They, they hung in there. And, uh, you know, we said it was going to be different when we came back here in two years. And, uh, you know, that's a great football team. It really is. And, uh, you know, for our guys to come in and be able to do what we did, I mean, that's. It's a tribute to our team, and I uh, take nothing away from them. That is a good football team. I get the sense you're kind of emotional right now. Well, <laughs> we've come a long way. We, we really have. We've come a long way, and I'm so proud of our players because they bought into what we said we had to do, and, and, and uh, they've done it. And uh, our fans, I'm, I'm so happy for the Illini Nation. I mean, these people have... Uh, Kind of taking us in, it's really it's a, it's a neat thing. It really is. Look back at last year's games, Ron. Juice really struggled. You benched him for a time. What was the difference between last year and this year that enabled him to have a career day? Well, I mean, he's a he's only a sophomore, and and uh, you know he was a freshman, and and last year, and I, I mean, it just he's going to get better. Uh, he'll be better as a junior than you know, and he'll be better as a senior. So you know, I think players, you know, they get better. Uh, you know, they're going to be better players as juniors and seniors than they are freshmen and sophomores. I got to ask you, one of the critical downs, the fourth and one, there's about seven minutes left, called a timeout. What was that discussion well, like about whether well, you're going to go for it or Coach not? Coach Tressel called the timeout. I, 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 uh, I was going to punt it and uh, Juice came up to me and he grabbed me and uh, you know what? You got to believe your players. You got to believe in them and we do believe in him, and he said, Coach, I will get it. And I said, you better get it, and he did.